So, college. Yeah, college. Good morning, Jacques. Good morning, how are you? Dr. Burnham. Campus Confidential emerged, strangely, out of discussions I was having with parents my age. They were very, very confused, and a lot of the information that they had about what made a college experience important or seminal or luminous or just, just really fulfilling for a kid, a lot of the information was off. Uh, I'm the guy who never left college. There's nothing I know more about intuitively uh, than the American college experience. And what I know, quite frankly, worries me a little bit. One thing is a school that has a very well built out, well thought out, uh, rigorous experiential learning program. A program in which professors work one-on-one -on -one or in small groups with students on meaningful projects for both the professor and the students. Uh, second, it's an old saw, but it's an oldie and a goodie, is class size. Let me repeat it. Class size, class size, class size. Uh, if you're sitting in classes that have 50, 60, 70, 80 people, you're being massified. It's not good to be massified. Uh, if your faculty members are all abused adjuncts, if they're all part-time professors, if they're being paid uh, wages that are well below the poverty line, uh, they don't come to class happy and they can't focus on the great American undergraduates. Uh, Campus Confidential aspires to keep it real. Uh, I think there are a lot of stories about college that are either not being told or are not properly understood. There is so much misinformation uh, that is radiated out of um, college and university PR departments uh, that parents need to be very, very discerning. In, in many ways, I'm trying to relay an inconvenient truth. Don't believe the hype. Do, don't, don't believe the hype. No, don't believe the hype. Don't believe the hype. Don't, don't, don't believe the hype. Don't, 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 don't believe the hype. Yes, was the start of my last.